But we begin tonight with how a court has heard that the Nottinghamshire mother who went missing with her two young sons made false allegations against their father. A judge said Samantha Baldwin's claims that he'd abused the boys weren't true. He also said that she gave them drugs to try to prove her claims. Our social affairs correspondent Jeremy Ball is here for us tonight. Uh, Je Jeremy, why has the judge spoken out like this? Well, Judge Jeremy Lee said people needed to know some essential facts because there's been so much ill-informed speculation about this case. You'll remember that Samantha Baldwin was arrested at the end of last week on suspicion of abducting her two sons. This is after the police found them all in a holiday cabin on the edge of Sherwood Forest. And it followed that nationwide missing persons hunt that went on for more than a week. Now, today the judge revealed that started when Samantha Baldwin abruptly left his courtroom while he was making a ruling on what contact their father should have. And he said she took the boys away to prevent the court from deciding what should happen to them. Let's talk about those abuse allegations again. What did the judge have to say about them? Well, in a nutshell, his judgment made it clear that Samantha Baldwin's claims simply weren't true. His Honour Judge Lee spelt it out. He said the father had not perpetrated sexual, physical or emotional abuse against the boys as alleged by their mother. He said the allegations made by the mother were false. Samantha Baldwin genuinely believed he had done it, but her belief was irrational. And the judge added, in order to try to prove her case, she caused the boys to ingest substances. Now, these were two sedatives that would give rise to a positive drugs test. In short, the judge said she was trying to obstruct the court's decision. And these two boys are now in local authority care. OK, Jeremy, thanks very much.